Hello, my name is Representative Pam Powers Hanley and I represent LD9 in Tucson in the Arizona House. Well, today's video is about prison reform and sentencing reform. You may realize that for the last few years in the Arizona House, we have been very focused on prison reform and sentencing reform. Many bills have been proposed uh, in a bipartisan fashion. Uh, there were committee meetings uh, that met throughout the summer a few years ago, and pretty much none of those bills got anywhere, even though there was bipartisan support for reform. So this year, with Representative Walt Blackman chairing the Criminal Justice Committee, um, they are releasing many really good prison reform bills from that committee. Unfortunately, along with those good bills on sentencing reform and prison reform, there are also some bad bills that um, add additional mandatory sentencing to our laws. And so we're working against ourselves if we're trying to reduce the prison population and make things fairer for the people when we pass more mandatory sentencing. So we, we voted on a bill today in the House 2889. I, it was a mandatory sentencing bill. Um, it was related to child sexual abuse. Uh, I voted no. I was the only person who voted no on this mandatory sentencing uh, bill. And yes, it's a tough subject, but if you're against mandatory sentencing, you're against mandatory sentencing. And so why would I vote against this bill? Because we know that the uh, justice system in the United States is not colorblind. Uh, we have far more uh, men and women of color in prison than we do people who are white. And so if we had a fair justice system and if justice was actually blind in the United States, you would see our prison population uh, be more reflective of the country's population, and that is not the case now. We also know that laws can be applied differently to different types of people. This happens all the time in the United States, unfortunately. Um, people are entrapped, and that's where man mandatory sentencing is a bad idea, a really bad idea. So. This has come up before. Uh, often I am um, an outlier on some of these votes. In fact, a few weeks ago, there was a mandatory sentencing bill. And again, I was the only person in the House that voted no. And then a day later, somebody brought it up for reconsideration. And when we voted on it again, all of a sudden more Democrats were no votes. I'm not sure if it's gonna happen on 2889, but I think it should. If we're against mandatory sentencing and if we actually embrace the idea that the system is not fair, then, you know, I'd say why not vote with the American Civil Liberties Union and the Attorneys for Criminal Justice and other groups like the Friends uh, Service Committee. They were all against 2889 and I am with them. We should not have mandatory sentencing and we need prison reform in this state. We have far too many people incarcerated and the system is not fair. So, good night. See you tomorrow.